So to summarize, the amino phenotype, the abnormal B cell population shows expression of CD10. Um, CD19 is expressed, although it may be mildly decreased relative to the small um, reactive B cells. C20 is present and perhaps mildly increased relative to the reactive B cells. CD38 is increased. Of course, we have dim kappa surface light chain restriction, normal expression of CD45 without expression of CD5 or BCL2. So follow-up studies on this patient immunohistochemistry also confirmed the presence of a CD10 positive BCL2 negative B cell lymphoma. The specimen was also sent for, to look for a MIC rearrangement by fluorescence and cytohybridization. hybridization. It was present, and so the patient, based on all the information, was given the diagnosis of Burkitt lymphoma. The patient also subsequently had a, um, a lumbar puncture, so cerebral spinal fluid was aspirated. That material was sent for flow. And it also showed an abnormal B cell population very similar to what we have just observed in the patient's bone marrow. The patient was subsequently given interthecal um, systemic chemotherapy. So for, to do this, they have to inject the chemotherapy in the spinal canal. And as of February 2020, when we last had information about his clinical course, um, the patient had gone back to work and was in remission from his lymphoma. <clears throat> 